Moving on to news from Afghanistan, Afghan security forces have made a demand for support to fight insurgency in eastern Nangarhar province as the Taliban forces increase their attacks in recent weeks. Meanwhile, the U.S. and its NATO allies are still assessing a request to send a few thousand more troops to the country. As the United States and its NATO allies decide whether to increase the number of troops assigned to Afghanistan, local forces on the ground demand more troops and equipment to beat the Taliban and other insurgent groups. Brigadier General Mohammad Naseem Sangeen, who has been leading his brigade in a clear operation to drive insurgent fighters out of Chapahar district in eastern Nangahar province, said that the forces need additional reinforcement, weapons and high-end equipments to hold the ground. Despite upbeat assurances from foreign and Afghan officials about progress in improving leadership and fighting endemic corruption, the security forces have struggled to contain the widening Taliban insurgency and now control no more than 60% of the country. In Nangarhar, which is a stronghold of Islamic State militants, but otherwise is a relatively stable province, the army is now conducting active operations in nine districts, compared with just three last year. <laughs> 